Christmas to the following wonderful Patreons! And the rest of you, I guess. Bjorn Van Ryzen, Bryce Winter, Harmelodic, Jack1098, Jeffrey Bowen, Rick Harmson, Ryan Bolter, Selwyn Nipples, and Steven Tim. Hello, procrastinators! Merry Christmas and welcome back to... Kenneth! Kenneth Cern! Absolutely and perfectly on cue. As always, oh shit, fucking set me off. Anyway, I might as well give you a little bit uh, of an update. Kenneth, after fleeing New Mexico several hundred times, uh, has uh, returned to the big city where it all began. Yes, yes, you're evil. We get it. He's paid off a lot of his debts. He's kind of going for a bit more of a, a restart in life. He's kind of, he's trying to reset. By his estimation, there's only about three or four percentage of the people that he has fucked off that still want to kill him, which is not bad, really. But yeah, this is Kenneth in the big city. This is his second chance. Well, it's like 900th second chance. Also, every time he fled to Mexico, wasn't Mexico. Wasn't none none of the times it was actually Mexico. But um, yeah. Anyway, he's all right. He's okay. And uh, you should uh, you should note that he is older. He is greyer. And that scar, do you know he got that? Falling off his bike. Quick look around his digs. We've got a bedroom with a poster of me. We've got another bedroom for children. So that one won't be used. Uh, we... That was there when we moved in. Got a bathroom. Ooh, where you can poop and then wash your poopy bum. And then we've got the kitchen. Wow. And Kenneth is mixing uh, some brownies right now. Look at that. He's cooking. He's learned how to cook. Oh, now attack it with a spoon. Look at the skills of this man. Yeah, pour that in there. Bosh! Got anything else planned for today, or are we just gonna... Just gonna stand here? Okay. Oh, there we go! And the brownies are done! Hey! Look at that. Self-sufficient! Oh, and for those of you wondering where Batman is... Batman is serving several consecutive life sentences, and we don't need to talk about that. Oh, what are you doing, Kenneth? Yeah, always brush your teeth. Always brush your teeth before eating brownies. That's good. Yes. Don't know why you keep the toothbrush there. Oh my god, he's changed his clothes. Oh, I don't like that. He didn't eat the brownies either. Kenneth, are you okay? Oh my god, he's gone outside. What the fuck? You say hello to people. Yeah? What are you doing? Are you fighting with a child, Kenneth? He does hate children. That's a very important point. Oh, Kenneth, Kenneth, come on. No, 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 no. I know you don't like children. Oh, so this is a really weird way to have a conversation. Are you having it through this? Oh my god, could you stop fighting with the fucking woman and child, please? Did you just... <laughs> yeah, well, you probably deserve that, you fucking idiot. You walk away to... Oh, look, he's spying from the bush. He's like, oh, help, help. There's consequences to my actions. Oh, Kenneth's on his way back up to his apartment. But look! Friends are visiting and they brought cake. Look, new people to welcome into the building. Hey, Kenneth. Okay, he's not that guy. So, see you later. Ah, oh, there he goes. He's happier now. <laughs> oh! Uh, why did you kick me in the teeth? Okay, so, Kenneth, sweetie, let's talk this through. You gotta stop being cruel to people, okay? Be cruel to people all your life. And where has it got you? The big city. Nobody wants to live in the big city, now do they? Are you sad? Yes, of course you're sad. Don't fight the shower! The shower is not the reason that you're sad. You think a shower's gonna flinch, you fucking idiot? Why'd you walk through a door? Who the fuck is that? Okay, so apparently this is Penny from like the apartment next door. <sighs> Kenneth. Oh, she enjoyed it though. Maybe they'll be friends. Or maybe they'll have a big fight. It's been uh, about four minutes since Kenneth moved into the house. Good to know things are basically the same as they've always been. And another fight. Okay, I'm gonna go and make myself something to eat. You want anything? No? Okay. Ooh, brownies. Okay, so Kenneth is now done crying in the bathroom again. And she's still here. Oh. Oh, so you're going to the bedroom for the... Did you just put cat blood in her face? This is why you have no friends, Kenneth. This is why you keep fleeing the country. There's no countries left. This is your last chance. And Penny's gone home and they're both slammed doors. Oh. <laughs> and immediately the door opens. How oh, is he going to apologize? Nope. No, I think he's going in. 
Oh, shit. Okay. Well, she's had a change of dress. Oh, you got a much bigger TV. It's a bit close, isn't it? What are you playing? Something. Oh, some sort of Mario Kart thing. And have you... Okay, so Ken's just come over to play The Sims. <laughs> oh, he's slagging her house off. Stop slagging her house off! She invited you to a house and she got done up for it really quickly! Be friends! Yeah, there you go. Well done. Be friends. Oh my god, what? <gasps> Look at that. That is a man. <laughs> that is a man. <laughs> Ah, oh, it's been a few years, but he hasn't changed, has he? Okay, we've gone to the karaoke bar to call off, haven't we, Kenneth? Because you're being a naughty boy. Smash. We don't like it when you're a naughty boy. Where are you going? Are you going to get a drink? Ah, I've taken him to a place with alcohol. This feels like a terrible idea. Oh my god, what are you doing? Did you just... What? What did you just do? Did you pinch her ass? Look at this guy rocking out. To a crowd of two people that aren't listening, a guy that's about to enter, and oh god, can it's my friend? Why do you piss people off the moment you fucking talk to them? Oh. He's going home. See you later, Kenneth. Oh, he's doing a little spin. Excuse me, excuse me. Kenneth, where are you going? Kenneth, I can't go any faster than this. Kenneth? Kenneth? Oh, that can't be good. What the fuck? I think Kenneth's outside. We need to talk about the uh, mysterious incident that just happened. Why are you slagging off a child? What the fuck is wrong with you? All right, we got to talk. What did you do? What did you do? What did you do? Well, that was an interesting way to piss. Oh, uh oh, Kenneth, 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 the child has moved in. He's like, hmm, yeah, it's interesting. Why is the... Uh... Oh, he's just getting some food. Okay. Kenneth, are you covered in blood? Kenneth! It's the Christmas special! Don't be covered in blood! Yeah, you can always have blood, you fucking idiot! Oh good, he's finally noticed the, uh... Random child that's in his room looking mean. Oh! Shit, you did not just fall for that! Oh! Oh! <laughs> The problem is, that's fine. You can do that to a child. It's funny. Can it just always takes it too fucking far? Unless the child will take it too far. Oh no. No, he's telling the child that their mother's dead. And now he's regretted it to break. Alright, Kenneth. Well, be nice. Kenneth? Kenneth? Kenneth, where did you get that knife from? Kenneth, is that child dead? You can't just make brownies every time you try and off someone. It's weird. It's like you've got a poker tell. <laughs> yeah, I know. I thought we'd get through the evil stage. Oh, he's still by legs. Don't try and stab the bowl! You can't just stab a bowl. Is that kid genuinely dead? He's making brownies. He already has brownies. The only thing he fucking owns is brownies! Oh fuck, what's he doing to that child? He's leaving the child there. Okay, I found him talking to a random woman outside who is giving him some fucking evil face. I'm not a body language expert, but I don't think this is someone who likes him. Why has he got us him? <laughs> He's gone full psychopath. You never go full psychopath, Kenneth. Oh, he's gone. Where's he gone? Where are you going? Kenneth, where are you going? Oh, he's scared of mascots. I always forgot that he was scared of mascots. Okay, so this has got a bit weird. Uh, this mascot has decided to fall asleep over here. Kenneth, on the meantime, has decided just to wander around in circles and turn blue. Which is not something I was expecting from him. Well, I don't know why you're doing it for me. Do you want to fucking go with me? It's me, right? You can try and fuck up the fourth wall because I'll fucking destroy you. You know, I know you're not looking at me. I know you're looking at them. It's kind of... You're looking at them, right? Why do you hate mascots so much? What did a mascot do to you? <gasps> Does it remind you of Batman? Aww. 
What's that person's like violin? And I know you hate violins as well. I'm pretty sure it's like one in the morning or some shit while she's playing that outside, like where people sleep. Which I think is pretty cruel. Kenneth, could you just fucking go to bed, please? You're freezing. Okay! <laughs> okay. Um, again, not me. I didn't. I'm gonna go. I didn't see anything. Kenneth, don't kill death. Okay. Whew. He's just giggling to himself as he wanders off. Back to bed. All right, Kenneth, get yourself some sleep. Sleep. Rest, you good boy. There we go. Well, calm down a bit. Tomorrow we'll deal with the mess you made out there. Well, at least the body's gone. Uh, wait, where the fuck's the body gone? Morning, sleepy. Did you sleep well? Yes? What the fuck are you doing? Why are you poisoning this chair? Why are you just poisoning... Just randomly poisoning brownies, yeah. Are you also about to eat one of those brownies you literally just poisoned? Is that... Is that... Should I be worried about that? I'm actually starting to get really worried about Kenny because I think he is getting unhinged now. Because, um... Okay, well, I just turned around and a random man has gone into his room. <laughs> Who the fuck just got into this guy's room? Who are you? What are you doing? Why is this random man uh, coming just to check himself out in the mirror? Yeah. Kenneth, do you want to finish showering? There's a dude in your house. <laughs> There's just a man in your house, Kenneth. Oh, there he is. Ah! Come down, I'm fucking down now, son. Oh. No, behind you. What are you going in here for? Or are you going to evilly eat a brownie? Dude, you like brownies too much. Oh, he's sneaking his brownie into the bedroom. Ah, he's going to... Oh, he's seen the man! He's seen the man! The man has now stormed out. And nothing happened. What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, you didn't just fucking blow your... Oh, he's fine! The fuck was that? What? Why is this guy now on fire? Why are you covered in blood? What happened? You can't just leave and there's a man on fire in your bedroom. I mean... Where did all that blood come from? Did you shoot a bird on the balcony or something? Alright, so Kenneth's got a nice uh, big smile on his face as a man immolates inside his bedroom. Oh god, what's happening now? Is that guy still alright in there? I think he's... Stop screaming, so that might be a good sign. Hang on, let's creepily walk over and check on him, shall we? Da -da -da. Da -da -da. Maybe not the best sign. Okay, so Kenneth's having a good time. You feeling it? You feeling it, buddy? You gonna watch some TV? Okay, we'll just let death deal with the... Uh, the smelly dead guy in your room. <laughs> Even death's like, what the fuck, man? And you're just gonna sit there and watch. The Disney live-action remake of Aladdin, sorry, Will Smith. You are evil! Oh, death's done. Alright, just, you can, what, slip him a fiver or something? Oh! What? You can't kill death, I think! Can you kill death? Does that work? Is that working? Does he have a neck? This is taking a while, I don't think it's... Okay. Okay, now Death's panicking, you put on winter wear. I don't know what's happening anymore. Okay, so the plot twist I did not see coming. Death has put on a winter coat. <laughs> and is now running away. Oh, can he stick it up on Death? Oh, he's run past him. There we go. All right, where's Death going? Where? <laughs> you right, Death? Oh, he sees Death! <laughs> What's happening? Oh no, there's a new death! There's a new death come to get the body of death! Oh, this one looks pissed! Okay, well he's fucked death off so Kenneth's on the fucking run again. Probably to Mexico, wherever he thinks that is this time. See you later, Kenneth Kennethson, you wonderful little weird bastard. 2028, 20, that's when we'll probably see you again. Somewhere around then. Who knows as he goes off. Oh, he's waved to someone. Someone's waved to him. Who's that he's talking to? I can't see from here. And he shot them! <sighs> Merry Christmas.
going to say Christmas Eve is coming soon Now are you dear old man Whisper what you bring to me Tell me if you can When the clock is striking twelve When I'm fast asleep Down the chimney broad and black With your past Just one, you'll be sure to know. Oh yeah, he said, okay, he said the luchador. Oh my god, an RKO out of nowhere! Holy shit!